Uh, thank you, uh, Dr. Inoue. Well, uh, his remarks makes me really relaxed. Thank you. And good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Shuji Kashiwada, Japan Racing Association International Department. And my topic for today is Arima Kinen. Uh, I don't want to disappoint you, but this is not a new race concept, but it's time-tested concept. First, Arima Kinen was established in 1956 and it was first run as Nakayama Grand Prix. It came from a pro proposal by JRA's second president, Mr. Yoriyasu Arima, who initiated the idea of creating a new race that would boost the popularity of Japanese horse racing. The concept of the race was an all-star horse, all game of horse racing based on fan vote, which was modeled on the all-star game of professional baseball. Unfortunately, Mr. Arima passed away the following year. Then the race was renamed Arima Kinen in recognition of his great achievements. It is currently held on Sunday in December around Christmas time, run over 2,500 meters on top at Nakayama Race Course in Chiba Prefecture. First of all, I would like to show you the video titled The Day of Arima Kinen, which was filmed last year. Stefelio counts the gates, as did out wide for Cosmia, going on Armadai. In behind them is Velox, costing a little bit of ground back in behind them is Armadai, who gets some cover but now presses on. They've got 400 metres to run. Stefelio joined on the outside by Alain. His, they're running on Firamon, and along the inside is Armadai. And then on the outside, at least for sure, the Cox Plate winner, Javian Lane. Races away and least for sure wins in a canter. Beats Saturnalia, world premier late. Then came Kiseki, followed by Firamon. Then came Cheval Grand. It's such a great privilege to ride in the Aaron McKinnon especially on a horse like Liz, Liz Grisher. And, uh, I'd like to thank the JRA for the special license to, to be here today. Also, all the fans that voted for her to be in the race, all the fans that have come out today and made it such an amazing day. Uh, just thank you to everyone, everyone in Japan. And first, found vote for
for Arima Guinean takes place during the last half of November and helps to gradually build anticipation for the race. JRA accepts the votes in three patterns. First, voting at race courses and of course betting sites. Second, internet voting through the official website. And third, voting by email, uh, by mail. Each person can vote up to 10 horses. The maximum field for the race is 16. The nomination for the race is closed two weeks prior to the race. Of the 10 horses nominated then, the, sorry, of the horses nominated then, the 10 horses that have received the highest number of votes are entitled to run and the rest of the field is determined based on their earnings. The total number of votes cast for last year's Arima Kenning was more than 1.57 million. Am and I received the most votes with more than 100,000 votes. From these figures, you can see the high degree of interest that the Japanese racing fans have in Arima Kinen. Looking at the percentage of each voting pattern, 80% was through the internet, 18 was cast at race courses and of course betting sites, and 2% was by mail. Usually, highly rated horses account for most of the top places in fan vote. However, in 2018, Oju Chosan, a champion jumper who is hugely popular among racing fans, gathered more than 100,000 votes, which was third in the fan vote. He was the fifth favorite in the race under the superstar jockey Yutaka Take. He fought very well to finish ninth out of 16 and crossed the finish line to a great applause. Uh, these are the facts and figures of Ari Makinen. Actually, Ari Makinen has the largest betting turnover in Japan. Last year, it had a betting turnover of 43.6 billion yen or 400 million US dollars, and on close attendance was more than 90,000. Given that Japanese Derby had the second largest turnover with 26.2 billion yen, it is easy to see just how dominant Arima Kinen is in Japan in terms of betting turnover. I should note that highest betting turnover ever recorded Arima Kinen was 87.5 billion yen or 800 million US dollars that was in 1996. And its highest attendance ever was 177,000 that was in 1990. These were the records from an era when horse racing enjoyed an unprecedented boom in Japan. The time between the 19, uh, late 1980s and mid 1990s was when Joki Yutaka Take made his brilliant debut and was breaking numerous previous records. And when a galaxy of legendary horses like Oguri Cap attracted racing fans and created a social phenomenon. By the way, JRA conducts horse racing throughout the year. However, we establish two peak seasons when the weather is nice and good for racing, which is spring, April to June, and autumn, October to December. Most of the G1 races are held at these times. The spring season culminates with Tokyo Yushin or Japanese Derby at the end of May. As you know, the Derby Stakes was first run in 1780, in Great Britain, the best place of horse racing. And some say that the creation of Derby is one of the greatest inventions in the history of horse racing. Accordingly, Japanese Derby is the highest goal for everyone involved in the Japanese racing industry, and it is the pinnacle of the spring season. On the other hand, 
Tenno Show or Empress Cup Autumn and Japan Cup are held as middle distance championship races for older horses in autumn. And the final championship race of the year is Ari Makinen. It is called the Dream Race. A dream race in the sense that fans follow the race intently after entrusting their final dreams of the year to their favorite horses through fan vote and betting ticket purchases. In addition, the mood in Japan at the time of Arima Kinen in late December is a mixture of distinctive ear and excitement and anticipation for the new year. Even those people who do not go racing regularly do bet on Arima Kinen. So it is like a national event for the Japanese people. To change the view slightly now, I would like to show you our media publicity and promotions for Arima Kinen. In JRA, we signed year-long promotional contracts with ad agencies that feature some famous celebrities on JRA promotions. And we conduct media publicity throughout the year using a variety of media, including TV, radio, newspapers, magazines, outdoor advertising, websites, and so on. Prior to Arima Kinen, in addition to these regular promotions, we expand exposure and conduct more promotional activities such as holding street events and setting up a special website. I would like to show you some examples of our promotional activities. These are the examples of advertisement in printed media, such as newspapers, weekly and monthly fashion magazines, and comics. Next example is outdoor media, billboard advertising and ad posters in the trains and subways, and at major train stations with the, in the metropolitan area. And we place web banners on the top pages of major portal website, post commercial films to YouTube and SNS, and operate the special website in collaboration with the popular animation. Moreover, we hold street events at train stations in the major cities such as Tokyo, Osaka, Nagoya, and Fukuoka. We also organize large-scale promotional activities that include distributing newspaper extras, hosting talk shows led by famous celebrities, exhibiting statue of the past Arima Kinen winner. I think that by having the publicity all over the city, Arima Kinen talks preoccupy the city, thus succeed in stoking excitement for the race among among not only horse racing lovers, but also the public at large. For the past few years, we have been creating a series of commercial films called Weekend Memories to generate interest in the race and approach racing fans more directly. Shown on TV, website, and other media, they are made based on the theme what if all the legendary horses in the Japanese racing history were to step through the time and compete against each other? The film describes the fascination of horse racing and inspires the feeling of hope for a new generation. I think this film can be associated with the concept of Arimakinen. Now please take a look at the film. いくつもの思い出を積み重ねていったら見るはずのない光景がまぶたに浮かんだ夢の第11レース1枠1番悲運の伝説となった馬番にサイレンス鈴鹿が再び入ります隣に目白マックイン国家はダービーと同じ馬番です東海帝王スペシャルウィーク庭園オペラ王がいますアグネス・タキオン足毛の怪物をブリキャップエル・コンドル・パサ
時代を超えて名馬たちが続々とゲートに向かいます無敗の三冠馬シンボリルドルフなじみのシャドウロールで成田ブライアンキングカメハメハ鬼の末足ミスターシービーズ日本競馬の手法ディープインパクトさらに歴代の女王たちエアグルーブブエナビスタダイワスカーレット大外18番正規の暴れん坊オルフェーブルです時代を超えて取った歴代の名馬たちゲートに収まってスタートしました先頭サイレン通過後続と小橋二番手ダイバスカーレットそれをマークするように目白マックインシンボリウドルフは中段で動きませんスペシャルウィーク父の後ろにブエナビスタがつけましたオルフェーブル早めにじわりと上がっていくミスター CB リーグインパクトは岩田候補夢の第11年数々の伝説が駆け抜けていく勝負の行方はまだ分かりませんさあ第4コーナーから最後の直線いつもの思い出が横一線に並んでこれは分からないこれは分からない逃げる逃げるサイレンスがそこから相手を手伸ばしてくれるかあああらエブリィアオンデセーステイビフォーアリマキネンコネクションズオッドランナーズギャダーインアトーキョーホテルフォーダポーストポジションドロー Since 2014, the draw has been broadcast live on TV. The drawing horse numbers is performed by the horses' connections who draw the lot. s However, to make the draw more of a gala event, we invite the famous celebrities to perform the draw to determine the order in which those lots will be drawn. In 2014 and 16, Masahiro Tanaka, a pitcher for the New York Yankees of Major League Baseball, served this role and attracted considerable media attention. He's well known as a racing enthusiast and loves betting. Last year marked the 64th running of Arima Genin. It has been the scene of numerous great contests over the years. One of every two Arima Kinen winners went on to become the horse of the year for that year. And for many great horses, Arima Kinen has been their final race before retirement. Recently, the Japanese Triple Crown winners, Deep Impact, o f e v o Gentil Dona, capped off their racing career with an impressive win in this race. Their retirement ceremonies were held on the day after the race. As the cold wind blew, many racing fans watched and appreciated their majestic figures for one last time. Deep Impact, one of Japan's greatest race horses, died last summer. He won Arima Kinen in 2006 in a brilliant style. And retired on the same day. The scene was very moving and continues to be talked about many racing fans to this day as the unforgettable moment. In closing, here is the video of Deep Impact Retirement Ceremony. This is the end of my presentation, Arima Kinen People's Participation in the Dream Race. Thank you very much for your kind attention.